Welcome to Pointwise's Tutorial Tuesday, where we show you how to use a feature or demonstrate a technique in just a couple of minutes. Today we're talking about preparation for Flashpoint, Pointwise's new 18.4 surface meshing tool. A couple quick things to know about Flashpoint. Before you use it, you want as few watertight models as possible. One is best, but Flashpoint will still work if there's more than one. The other thing to know is just like in previous versions of Pointwise, wherever you have one quilt, that will be one domain when Flashpoint is used. So with that said, let's get to an example. Here we have two models. You can see here over here in the list, and I've colored them differently. We want to assemble these into one model. So the best way to do this is going to be create, assemble, models. Select both, we can see two models selected, click assemble, they're down to one model, looks good. Now I can select all of the quilts and use rainbow colors to see where they are. And now I can start assembling quilts to make set up where domains will be. So real quick. All in all, I have nine quilts, which means when I use Flashpoint, I should have nine domains. So let's select the model, click the shortcut for Flashpoint, and see what we get. I'm going to turn off databases to make looking at the domains a little bit easier. But here's what we've got. Actually, we can see some T-Rex used on this surface over here, some T-Rex off of this. Let's actually look at the whole quality, examine area ratio. We've got an area ratio around three. Let's set it to max included angle. Maximum included angle 116. So based upon metrics, we got a pretty nice surface mesh here with some T-Rex applied. Let me show an example with multiple models. Okay, so here's an example with multiple models. I know it's not the most complicated example, but you get the point. We have two clearly distinctive models. I can select them both at the same time, click flashpoint, and I will still get a surface mesh. If you like this video, be sure to click the thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. If you have any questions or comments, drop us a line down below or connect with us on Twitter, which is linked in the description. Thank you all. Have a great Tuesday.